Mr. Speaker, the President of the United States. President Biden was greeted with cheers and jeers at his State of the Union address. In the 73-minute speech, he urged Congress to help him finish the job of rebuilding the economy. Other key points included policing, infrastructure, and tax reform. But how many heard his message? The speech had the smallest TV audience in three decades, and in my informal poll of about 20 people on Penn State's campus, none had watched it. I didn't know it was on last night. Not everyone may have watched President Biden address the nation last night. However, many caught snippets of it through other platforms. I was in a meeting last night, but I just saw little bits about it on social media. Biden's age is also a growing concern among many voters. A new AP poll shows a majority of Democrats don't want him to run again. Voters we talked with had mixed reactions. As much as I don't like him, I almost think it's like elder abuse, the way he's being like used and spun around. I would like to see somebody younger in office, but more politicians are older than we think they actually are. President Biden just happens to look his age. I think we should be focusing more on having an ideal candidate and somebody who is for the people and is going to be a good president for our nation. If he won again, Biden would be 86 by the time his presidency ended. In State College, I'm Paloma Freund for Center County Report.